If you don't think this crazy, I got more deal for you. Brody Lee. A wrestler, pro wrestler, dead at 41, man. And they said that he had a lung issue. The former WWE Intercontinental Champion died Saturday after battling a non-COVID-related lung issue. His family announced he was only 41. Lee real name, John Huber, was a superstar with the WWE from 2012 to 2019 before jumping over to AEW in 2020 and was a fan favorite with both organizations. He passed around by loved ones after a hard fought battle with a non COVID related lung issue. Now, let's get to Brody Lee. As y'all know, man, all these wrestlers just don't get this big out of nowhere. Don't get me wrong, they train. They actually lift weights and do all these aerobics and cardio and whatnots and all that. But on the real, though, they eat the roars. And swallow them down their belly until their belly about to pop until the point that they no longer or themselves like Chris Benoit when he off his whole family including himself and I tell you about these roars they make these dudes go crazy the roars does something to the body and it does something to every organ inside of the body and it's just another example is why you see these wrestlers like always in a rage and sweating like furiously like like a fountain of water just being poured out just just going crazy man and you know this is another death right out of the zoo stuff in the wwe and it's just death just going all around every sports i mean you got soccer the dan dude you got football players falling dead accidental shootings you got two wrestlers that's deceased now like what else would a ballerina or a ballerina gonna fall dead next i don't know but he died at 41 man they say he had a lung issue which tells me that it's most likely was offering to the goat pot belly lucy man because this dude was still up wrestling in 2020 and all of a sudden, you know what I'm saying, he just went down. And, you know, they always got to put that roni on everything, you know, just. You always hear the, the macaroni. But he, they say it don't got nothing to do with the macaroni. And I have never watched this dude wrestle. Don't know him. He probably was a good wrestler, who knows. But. For the business to go on, people gotta go. You know, that's how the world go. They, you know, they manifest enough negative energy to the point that it gets, uh, it gets you what you want. Basically, in this world ran by Pop Better Lucy himself. That's why I tell you, man, like, every person that got rich had to do something degrading to get there. Or something nasty. Just like a car salesman, he did something degrading, though. Or he did some some messed up things to get where he got to go to get this job. He sold people bad cars. Uh, just like the industry, man. You got to do something great. You know what I'm saying? That's how that go. And when you does that, you feed the goat. And in order for this WWE to continue, people got to go. Point blank simple. I don't like the way it is, but that's the way it is. What y'all think about Brody Lee checking up out of here, man, with a lung issue, bro? We don't know, but I know it's an offering for Pop Betty Lucy to make him even fatter. And to the point that Pop Betty Lucy, uh, he gonna have, his, his, his dookie gonna be stocked up for a while after collecting all these souls, man. You know. Pop Betty Lucy Belly is bigger than Santa Claus right now. For real, man. Let me know in the comment box. This is the messy robot. I'm out. And oh yeah, by the way, look. Uh, for the haters out there, make sure you tune in to all my videos and make sure you watch every last one on because y'all the loyal ones, and I love y'all. Y'all are the real ones. 
I always love people to come on here and leave a dislike because that's good. Let me know you in tune and uh, keep up the good work. You're doing a humendous job, by the way, supporting uh, Savage by News because it feels lovely to be back on YouTube.